Welcome back, ladies and gentlemen. I am so excited to be back with more reaction videos. I am Madden Gaming. If you're new to this channel, I drop anything and everything about Madden. Simulation, simulation, face of the franchise, franchise, ultimate team. I do it all. But... I'm doing something new, which is reactions, and also I got some really good news. If you go on my channel right now, you can go into any on the playlist on my channel. Go to the playlist, and you can see all my reactions of the USFL and any other reactions. That's why I'm. That's exactly why I'm be dropping them every time I upload them. And then this one, it is the championship game between the Stylings and the Stars. Now, I did not watch this yesterday, you know, family time and stuff, but I cannot wait to see who is going to take on, going to take that trophy and that money. I forgot how much money it is, but without further ado, let's get it. Now, this, I can't watch the actual highlights, so we just going to read what happened. First quarter, the Stars went three and out on their opening drive by the Stylings. Use their first possession to take three a three-point lead after a big game from Bobby Holly set them up for an early field goal. Philadelphia was quick to fire back with a field goal of its own, tying the score at three-three. Things then start to things didn't. Stay tied up for long, however, Birmingham found the end zone as the first quarter came to a close thanks to a fancy footwork of Stylings running back Bo Scarborough. Scarborough. He's from Alabama. With the score, the Stylings took a 10-3 lead heading into the second quarter. Okay. Second quarter, Stars quarterback Case Cooks dropped a dime on off of back shoulder toss to wide out Jordan Snell to bring Philly within one point earlier in the second wait earlier in the second frame 10-9 oh this show okay not watching it can't watch them on the assuring drive Stylings quarterback Jamar Smith got into the action connecting with Marlon Williams on a 41 yard bomb to give Birmingham a healthy lead once again 17-9 Okay, the Stylings added field goal ahead of break to extend their lead 20 to 9 after a monster run from Scarborough put Birmingham deep in enemy territory. Third quarter, the Stylin the Stars came out swinging in the second half. They made the most of their single third quarter drive as Cooks pull off a truly acrobatic throw on the critical third down to bring Philly within five points. That point is twenty to fifteen. He then broke down the play on the sideline, like they always do. This is the money quarter right here. Fourth quarter, the Stylings had a chance to extend their lead earlier in the final frame, but a missed field goal kept it a one-score game. These kickers, man, the USFL has been uh, up and down ride. The Stars then marched down the field to take the lead. Their drive aided by a personal foul against Cooks. The quarterback then found Devin Gray for a touchdown as Philly took a 23-20 lead. Ooh, can Philadelphia pull off the outside? They already done it once. It was another misstep for Birmingham as Stallings quarterback Alex McGall was picked off near the red zone, giving the Stars the ball right back mid-through. The frame Philly wasn't able to capitalize on turnover, however, and putting their weight after going three and out quickly. Can't go three and out, man. Matt Gall redeemed himself with a short touchdown pass to Victor Bolden that gave the Stylings back the lead 26 to 23 with just over three minutes left to play. Stylings then put themselves in great position, scoring quickly with Scarborough Wright took an interception back. 47 yards for a touchdown to make it 33-23. to 23. Oh, my God. Stars are crumbling. Stars managed to pull within 33 
to 30 on the touchdown pass by KJ Costello. I don't know what that is. And then Philly got to try the uh, wait the alternative to to our onside kick, allowing in the USFL instead of kicking it, the Stars could attempt to convert a fourth and twelve. The Stylings held, however, and it went on to take the and went on to take the crown. That's that's how that. I'm so sorry about that. That's how that ended. Go for it. Sorry about that. That's how that ended. Well, I'm gonna watch the highlights on YouTube on my own time. I can't upload them here because USFL be tripping. But I enjoyed the season. I really did. It was really fun to watch these players develop. It, it hey, Stylings won. They was the best team all year. <sighs> Wish New Jersey wouldn't had did what they did. You know, maybe that could be New Jersey, but Tampa Bay is coming next. Don't, don't worry about that. Tampa Bay coming back next season. Yeah, yeah, dig. Shout out to the one that always be in my comments. He did pick the styling, so shout out to you. You got what you wish for. Thanks for watching, guys. I will drop another reaction video. I have no idea, to be honest with you. You know what? I'm going to stop talking. Love you guys. Your boy is out.